chicks vomiting in like Shinto temples and then just like walking out. What a guy. What a dude. What a man. What, what a, a man. Dude, bro. He's getting so much action. All those Japanese ladies are like, what the fuck? Dude. See, he hasn't clarified that part. I don't know if they're Japanese or if they're American. Oh, I thought so, you were going for the lady part. The the date that he's going on is with a Japanese girl. Um, Ooh. When did when did you hear that? Just uh, he was he was kind of messaging me for advice a little like when he was like talking to her. Why was he messaging you? Uh, cool. I um, I concur with Kelvin's decision on this one. I would have messaged John. RJ, I'm a date. Oh, no. Obviously. RJ, no relationship I have ever had has failed on my terms, okay? You can't blame <laughs> me for any of those things. It's not that I blame you, it's just, like, Matt's the one actually in a relationship. Listen, marriage kills everyone. <laughs> so, <laughs> if you want to talk to a corpse, be my guest. If you want to talk to a real living boy... I mean, corpses can't come talk, talk back, so... You come talk to me, that's what you think. See plenty of dead men walking when they're married. Am I right? No. Just ask my wife. Oh, all right. I'm one of the worst ones to ask at this point. All right. Eh. RJ, did you ever like retest OBS and see if you could get it to? Oh run? yeah, I'm recording right now. Oh, you're recording too. Yeah. Oh, cool. gotta have that backup. Okay. In that case. What I'm going to do, if you're recording, because you're recording your stuff, so I'm going to lower my desktop audio so that it doesn't pick you up. Um, hey, what about John? Uh, oh, well, do you have your desk? John, would you be able to... Wait, what's... Do you have OBS, John, or no? I mean, James? What? Huh? If we were going to go that route, we all just do Audacity. I think for now, we'll just stick with what we've got. That's fair. I was just thinking about that for, later. Because the, the thing is, like, if we did ever want to edit together something, we would need to have at least, like... But if we were going to do that, at that point, we just all download Audacity for free, record through Audacity, and then stitch it all together. Free as well, isn't it? Huh? Yeah, o OBS is free. Yeah. But, like, Audacity is actually for voice, re for, like, recording. It's a specific audio recording software. I don't know. The quality I was getting out of... I thought the quality that we got was pretty good from... Uh, I just meant in terms of being able to, like, edit out background sounds. Oh. I well, the microphone anyway. Because so. we, we, can, <laughs> I mean, we, can we can always port in audio, too, from, from like, OBS. Put, turn it to, like, an MP4 and then, and then put that through Audacity. The problem is with, like, noise cancellation stuff or editing out background sounds... Like, if you wanted to edit out room room tone, that'd be really difficult, because it's just hard to kind of do that, like, and have the sound still sound natural, you know what I mean? But we'll figure it out. We'll figure something out. Whatever. So, here's what I got for you guys, if you want to play with this. Mm -hmm. Or we can just shoot the shit and maybe play video games or something. Yes. I was just going to see to my pants sci-fi bullshit like the first time. Oh shit, really? We're That's doing what I was thinking. I'm fine with that. I don't we don't have characters or anything, but that could still be fun. And that that was actually going to be part of it is you find out your characters as you go. All right. I'm definitely going to be my space cop again. John? Definitely gonna... Does that sound like fun? I'm done. Cool. Oh, I, I was, else I, was looking, I was looking as well into that Halo uh, RPG. And I'm going to take a deeper look at it because there's actually a whole Reddit, like a subreddit for it. Yeah. So I'm going to see what I can do with that. But I definitely think we should we should still... When's the next best time for everyone to meet, like, meet next up week. again? Like next week. We should definitely do next week, like a full a full session. That's and what I was thinking. I I think our biggest problem is that we simply we went for about like half of a normal session's length. You know what I mean? Uh, is it normal? Is it normal? The startup time. 
Depends on like, your group. Yeah. Well, like, like I've been in groups where we just go for like two to three hours. No, yeah, that's it. And we only recorded for about like an hour and a half of actual. We were all together for about three hours, but we didn't start recording anything really. Like for the we didn't start playing. Yeah, we didn't start playing until yeah. like like almost an hour in. I mean, if we we had to like make sure everybody's in though, and if we get started yeah. right away next time, we should be fine. Yeah, no, and I honestly I do think that we have. Like, place? We have like a better handle on the characters and stuff like that too. I feel like we'll, we just got to get settled in it. But yeah, I'm down. I'm down for whatever. I bought, <laughs> I bought like a bunch of 20, 20Ds. <laughs> and then I, I realized like, oh shit, I'm going to need more than just like a 20D to play to use this at this. <laughs> but any role I do, I do for a 20Ds, I'm going to use my 20Ds. But I will log it. Do you have a session for this on Roll20, RJ, or are you going to, like, No. Something? No? I mean, we could just use the same one. All right. Then we'll... Oh, shit. Is that in the Discord chat? I forgot. Is what what? I have to log in. Uh, the link. The Roll20. Uh, maybe. You just need to log into Roll20. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay. Yee, yee. Do, 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 do. That's very. Oh, that's not what I want. Boop. Uh, Sign in. Oh. I did. I think I have to remember my password for this. Yeah, hold on. I'm gonna have to do that. Email too. address. So I got dinner at the sandwich place near my dorm room, right? Uh. And as I'm checking out, the guy at the, behind the cash register says "Happy Holiday." <laughs> oh, because it's four twenty. <laughs> yeah. And you got a blaze. You got a blaze on four twenty, dude. Yeah, 420 and April Fools are like the worst days to be on the internet, and they both happen in the same month. <laughs> yep, but that means we can get all get all of it out at one time. Hey. Look, what did I put down for this? I can't remember. Da, 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 da. Fuck. Oh. <gasps> nope. Oh no. Hold on. I gotta check my phone. I gotta check my phone. Check your phone. Phone. Oh. Check the phone, everybody. Check on. Check, check on, on everybody. Check on. I rewatched that video just for like nostalgia, like a couple days ago. Yeah. I, like actually subscribed to the uh, their their channel. They Finally. Win. Good time. Or Chanel number five. Check on, check on everybody. Check on friends. Check on. Check on. Ah, uh, uh, this looks oh. like a good landing spot. What? Classic. It's from that video, mate. That Skyrim video. What? 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 Do you not remember, what? RJ? Do you not remember? I don't remember you. <clears throat> He fucking got me, dude. Oh, wait, did I sign in with... What was that? Oh, my... Shit, my... I heard somebody's voice that wasn't us. It's a ghost. It's a ghost on the line. I'm assuming it's not from James's end, then. It's a ghost. It sounded like a woman. It's a ghost. Well, my, I have my window open, so you might be hearing that. No, James, I can't hear through windows. Windows open. <laughs> oh. I can't hear through open windows. That's so it's worse to get up or something. Oh no. Where okay, hold on. It's James, did you not write down the password? Uh I can't even remember the email. Hold <laughs> <It's> on. <laughs> what? It should have. It should have sent an email to my account, right? I guess what it does. You would think.
unless you know you didn't use that email. I, I'm pretty sure he did. Almost. You used your regular email. Did you? Oh yeah, here we go. I got it. Yeah. Roll twenty. Blah 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 blur blow blow. All right, hold on. Hold on. I'm about to motherfucking handle this shit. <laughs> John, did you just what? prescribe me one window? <laughs> Hooray! <clears throat> oh, oh, fuck. Now I gotta sign into my email. Maybe, maybe we should just not. Where is it at this point? We. I'm making a person. Color my. Oh. Oh no. The person. He's gone. Bada bing, bada boom. But um, all right, there we goes. Now I know. He's cool uh, here we go. And now I am jo joining the game. <clears throat> oh, God, help. Are you escaping in the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism? What? Have, have I not shown you that? No, I don't think so. Oh my goodness. If you have, I just don't remember it. Oh my oh, god. <clears throat> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my. Oh, oh yeah. Launch the game. Oh, neither of you have played, so I can't tell. I, I'm gonna tell you anyways. So, there's a uh, there's this game, I Dark Overlord, right? Uh huh. And you are the min the players of the minions. It, it's like a card game. And, uh, players of the minions. Then one person's the Overlord. Minions have to explain why it's not their fault they failed the mission. Yeah. We adjusted this to be yes boss, where it's the same game. But it's a bunch of unpaid interns explaining to the CEO why they failed. <laughs> but you, it's just using the same cards as the base game. So while you're playing, you have to take these fantasy things and explain how, like, twist them to be business. Okay. Sounds pretty funny, actually. It was pretty fun. real fun because I was the boss and I was a, a Texan oil baron. Ta Yeehaw. Yeehaw, motherfucker. Yeehaw. <clears throat> yeah, did I... No, I did tell you guys I wrote a mechanical ball. That's yeah. Right. 55, 50 seconds? 55? Something like that? 50. Way longer than you should have? Oh, definitely. I was sore up until today. Cool. Ouch. It probably didn't matter in the moment, I bet. Could you not feel pain, John? Were you, were you pretty resistant to it pain? It was lots of fun. There you go. What's your favorite drink? What are your guys' favorite drinks? Uh, I guess ciders. That's tough. But I'm going to go with a uh, Malibu and Cherry Dr. Pepper. Yeah. day, that was pretty good. Nice one, John. What, what was yours, John, again? If I'm just doing anything general. Hmm. Oh, shit. What about the other day, that was pretty good. All right, All right, boys. Guess what? Hmm. What? Uh, we're gonna start. Whoa. Oh boy! Oh boy! Let's get launched. Let's get jazzed. Oh, we should probably. Okay, I'm actually gonna try and do a character voice though. Okay. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna uh, be. Just gonna let you guys know. I will be uh -huh. technically in character with you, uh, all the way. However, I am your AI. 
Okay. Oh, that that was something I was. Oh, wow, that's interesting. Anyway. What? Yeah. No, that's something I was thinking of doing for the Halo one too. Is like somebody be an AI or like having someone be an AI or like being an AI myself or something like that as a guide. But fair enough. We'll test it. Give you information updates and uh, minor assistance while oh. you are still the main players. So Ooh. wait, so I'll be my like ex. Do we just want to like describe the characters that we're envisioning really quick so we kind of know what we're going into? Uh, drop in an improv it. Drop um, in an improv it. Yeah, I'm gonna go with drop in improv it because that's the uh, scenario I've got. All right, that's fair. Uh, also, I have nothing prepared, so. <laughs> Good, because this will work real well for that. Uh, because the alarms are blaring as you begin to wake up. Oh, no. No, I go to school. Good morning. I mean, oh, oh, God. You are oh, approaching that's... your target destination. Please wake up from hypersleep. Oh, Jesus. I'm so sore. That is a side oh. effect. Uh, also oh, be aware yeah. that memory loss and limb fatigue are side effects, as well as the occasional vomiting. What about infertility? Is there any danger of that? Only oh, once. God, I hope, hope not. Uh, it's a, it only happens once. Oh, God, my virtual girlfriend's not going to like it. You just automatically get a vasectomy when you go into hypersleep. <laughs> 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 only if you check that box, although it's hidden between behind uh, about 50 walls in the program, so good luck finding it. Okay. Uh, Man, I, I'm having some weird memory loss. I, I can't exactly remember Captain. what the ship looks like what the ship looks like and you're gonna have to describe the surrounding i'm, I'm having a little bit of han solo uh carbonite uh blindness oh god i vomit on the floor <laughs> i gotta know i gotta know what it looks like where am i you're currently in the uh hypersleep bay okay uh, captain all right you're approaching <laughs> here. the planet Oh God! Uh, your bounty is on the planet as of right now, his okay. last known location. Cool, really cool. Uh, Captain, how do mm -hmm. you? Uh, we are approaching the planet in about an hour. Uh, how would you like to prepare? You can visit. You've got the armory, the supplies, and the data banks. Mm -hmm. Wait, am I the only one up right now? John's up too, but you're the captain. Um, uh. All right, uh, first mate, J first mate janitor, uh, oh God, I can't remember your name. We'll call you, I want to call you Jim. No, that's lame. I want to call you Tom in, Tom in. Ah, uh, yes, like that ancient Tom. cereal. Like the ancient cereal. That ancient Tom. cereal vid. Uh, I believe it was, uh, Interactive uh, activity of chairs. Tom and I don't <laughs> I don't remember this. I don't remember this at all. No, that's fine. That's just the pet name. I'll call you that. Uh, I I uh. <laughs> you, said, you said we you said we could go to the the armory or the data banks or. Be aware uh, that I can also access the data banks for you when you need it. Uh, why would we go there then? That's because some you people know what? don't like me. That's a good point, Tom. I can't. <laughs> Let's go to the database. You're right, that's a good point. I want to point out that it was my decision. <laughs> Write that in the log. Uh, uh, your name, computer man, is I'm gonna call you Stephen. All right, Stephen. Yes, Captain. Right. Right, that was my idea to go to the data banks. Keep that in mind. <clears throat> All right, Tom, and lead the way. So we go to the pretend. To the... I pretend to know where I'm going, and lead James through the corridors of the uh, ship. First mate Tomnin, you're going the opposite direction. Uh, turn around and take the first right. Or, the yeah, first, first right. Back. I see. I was. It's I was the, thinking it. The port. Then you port said side. It. Port side, see, I know. Port yes, is captain. right. Port is the right. I know that because I'm the captain and I'm always right. Ship's you log, are. put that in the ship's log. Fuck. Captain's log. 
Court is right. <laughs> Put it in there. Is oh, also go, guys. always right. <laughs> He's actually typing it in. Oh, God. Thank you, Steven. You're welcome, Captain. I would like to let you know, uh, there's a, a, the government is, on this planet is not as, uh, does not smile upon bounty hunters who destroy things with willy-nilly. Uh, that may change how you handle your tactics. I will course, have to attack the lead and slowly destroy everything. <laughs> I would like to remind you, you do right. have your official license from the intergalactic government to hunt bounties. And as such, you do have jurisdiction. That's that's good. That's real. I mean, like, I'd, I'd break shit even if I didn't have jurisdiction, because that's just the kind of guy I am. It is. You know, me. Uh, I Captain. Do. Captain. I've been uh, here for 12 years. Captain Tommen. I'm also Tommen. We're both Tommen. We're both Tommen. Yes, Captain. Uh, so are we at the data bank? We're, yeah, you're there. We're, going, we're at the data banks. So what's the, uh, give me a, give me a detail of the room. What's the room look like? Oh, sir. What? Yeah. What? Sir, I'd like to make a withdrawal from my account. <laughs> withdrawal from your account? I don't pay you in money. Uh, you no, do at the data have bank. to pay him in credits? I pay him in his name. I no, gave you sir. a name. You legally have to pay him at least some amount oh, to the money from the bounties. Oh, uh, as of right money. now, you have it set to 1%. We haven't made jack shit from the bounties. The last guy got away. I mean, not got away like I killed him, you know, but that's it getting away in like a spiritual sense. So. Uh, you currently have 200 credits in your account, Captain. And I can pay you. Tomlin has in the two credits. I can pay you in the teeth I've collected from bounties. Does that count? That's credits. That's no, worth something. Captain, some... Captain, Cap Captain, I have to warn mm. you that is technically illegal due, uh, according to the Bounty Guild standards. Uh, that's, well. I can't physically off. stop you, but you should know. All right. I give him like, I give him like 10 credits and a couple teeth as a bonus. I say, keep the change. <laughs> and then I uh very good captain then I key in the data bank and I say bring up bring up the the file on the on the bounty the Please. file pops up on the computer screen all right read it and read. Uh, it is uh <coughs> actually one moment I think I'm actually have something for this shoot where'd I put it Uh, a picture of a lizard man pops up on the screen. Mm -hmm. He's a really ugly looking fellow. Oh my god. What'd you say? What'd you say, Tommen? It's the Illuminati, Captain. Yeah, oh my god. And, uh, his the name? The most famous casino ring in the whole galaxy. The Illuminati casino ring. He did work at the Illuminati casino ring, and that's why you're hunting him down. He fled. Uh oh. And he took he a fled. number of secrets with him. Which the Illuminati, as one of the more upstanding governmental, or more, one of the more upstanding Casinos. corporations, uh, yeah. cannot allow this to happen. I'm sorry, Tom, but I, I want to get, I, you have like a real name, right? I don't want to, I want to keep calling you Tom, because that's, A, that's my name, and I just kind of nicknamed you that. I feel bad, the hypersleep hype really affected me. What's your, what's your name, Tom, and toss it oh. out to me. It's Tommen with an H. <laughs> with a Tommen with an H. T H O M I N. T and mine's just T O M. Yep. Oh yeah, I can see it on your name tag. I don't even know why I asked. Jesus. All right. Okay. So we're hunting a lizard Illuminati man. Uh, his name is Elok Rothenberger. Elok Burger. Waffenberger. Did you say Waffle Burger? Oh my God. That'd actually be really good. Tom and write it down. Steven, write it down. Waffle Burgers potential potential business idea. Write that down. Please. This? Huh? Burger burger. Uh burger. Almost most. It's uh actually I mispronounced it. My apologies. Uh Rothenberg 
Butter. Rotten Roth Butter Burger? <laughs> Is that what you said? My god, the plot thickens. Rotten Burger. He has so many food names. He's caught in the market. <laughs> in having a surname of food. Oh. Think of that fucking establishment name. Rothen Butter Burger Bugger uh, Bugger <laughs> Waffen Burger Waffle. <laughs> That's pretty, quite the name, sir. That's pretty good. You can only get a. It is. You can only get hot pretzels. Though. You can only get a hot pretzel stand. <laughs> he, he came from poor me. It's the file says he, he ran a pretzel stand. The Waffen Waffen Rothen Waffle Burger Bubble Burger Waffle Stand. <laughs> It only sold pretzels, and he, and he and it says that he went for a life in the Illuminati casino because he wanted to make something of himself. Uh, yes, that pretzels. is. It was the family business, unfortunately. It was. Uh, he was not very good at it. Wait, so he? Do we have an idea as to like what region of the planet that he's high? Also, what is he packing? Like, is this guy? He's not known oh. to be particularly dangerous. Although, okay. Uh, you're not the only ones looking for him. All right. And... Well, if I, uh, if I recall correctly, Captain, international luggage standards say you can't have more than 70 kilograms in any one bag at a time. So I don't know how much he could possibly be packing. He's right. Ah, oh, I see what you did there. You took my... He's only got, like, two arms, so he can't have that many bags. That's... He's... <laughs> he's... He's taken my... Tomden is quite correct, sir. He's pretty. He's pretty right. I'm very versed in that because I know you <laughs> everything. Are. Oh God. Yes. Um. Uh, med bay's uh, to the aft. No, I'm fine. I just, you know, <laughs> it's just a uh, hyperspace sickness and also syphilis. Um. Ah uh, yes. Let me think here. So. Tetris. Tetris, the most dangerous of the space sicknesses. Oh god, it's ravaged the galaxy. It's like polio, but worse because it kills you. Oh wait, polio killed people. It is. That's, it's like polio because it kills you. Um, we wiped out polio thousands of years ago, sir. No, well not this. Oh Fair enough. right, I forgot about that one. Sorry, glitch in the matrix. Um, this super polio was returned due to anti-vaccination efforts. <laughs> Damn. Damn those soccer moms. Uh, okay. Uh. So he's. It's do we know what? Football, sir. Do we? God damn it! Do we know what region of the you European? Do we know what region of the planet that he's hiding on? What? What was? He was last seen in the capital, in the in a, a small city, not far from the capital. Uh huh. Uh, it is believed to be hiding, with a local gang lord, who wants to sell his oh, information god. on the black market to the highest bidder. Ah oh, god. Well, you know what really take him by surprise? And I know we've done this a couple times and it's totally failed before. I say we crash our ship directly into the gang lord headquarters. Because, well, you know, so. nothing, nothing takes me. a man... No, nothing takes a man more by surprise than crashing your car into his living room. So I say we do that and see what happens. Tom, what do you think? Tom, with an H, what are you thinking? T-H? Thinking. Tom, we, uh... We pose as potential buyers for this information to lure him out right. instead, and then you crash the ship into him. Right. That's actually that's a better sales tactic. I I used to sell Indeed. door to door door to door lasers. And, so you sold uh, doors. I sold lasers in in uh, doors door lasers. I sold door lasers, and my yes, my sales, my sales tactic was always like you know crash crash your ship into the house because then they'll need to buy new doors no matter what you know but i never really got many repeat buyers probably because doors are a failing market anyway uh po point is i agree i say we 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 do what uh tom and with an h said yeah all right sir uh would you like to actually get in contact with the group and tell them you're interested in purchasing Hmm. Yeah. Listen, Thom, and you seem to be more the brains of this operation. So, I mean, you came up with the idea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let. I'm gonna. You're gonna. I want you to talk to him. I'll be like the muscle, you know, because I. 
I've got that. So you can do your thing. You're like a, you seem like a slick sales type. You can BS your way and stuff. We, we talk to these guys. We'll trust you with them. You know, I'd like to point out that I'm actually not in a suit. I'm in a bathrobe holding like a cup of tea. <laughs> and I got like a big, it's like a big velvet robe. I got a big fat cigar, like dangling out of my mouth. Yep. And yeah. Yeah. Spider-Man. Yeah. <laughs> So, Tom, and what do you say? Well, uh, well, you're the brains. You're the brains on the brawn. And the looks. You know how this uh, captain uh, first mate relationship works, but I'll go with it. That's that's what I like about you. You're willing to be the captain. <laughs> the most <laughs> important part of being a first mate. <laughs> what a guy. Uh, uh. Captain. It's like fighting a proxy war in Syria, but instead of killing Syrians, I'm having you sit in my chair. Thank you. I do my shit. Anyway. Um, Who do I call oh, captain right. now? He's he's the captain now. He I is don't... the captain now. That look at me. responsibility for me. Look at me. Domin, look at me. Look at me, Domin. No. Look at no. me. I, I slap I just, I slap him around a little bit. Like, slap, you know. I look at, I, I say... Look at me. You're the captain now. And I give him my bathrobe and my cigar and I walk off stark naked. <laughs> <laughs> so where do you walk to? I'm going to need pants. <laughs> I got to go to the armory. I'm going to chase something right. fierce. But you know what? You know what? It's what the captain would want. Thanks, captain. Yes, sir. Thank you. Yes, uh, sir, captain. <laughs> captain? We are about yeah. uh, thirty minutes from planet. Uh, would you like to? Uh, would you like to armory? Uh, would you like to access the armory before heading down? You talking to me or the other the captain? <laughs> yes. I'm, not a captain. I'm just the I'm just the second captain. Both. I'm getting my, I'm getting into my role right now. You know, I gotta get I gotta get into character. So I'm I'm. Tom, and what were you again? What, what were you? you? Called me your first mate like ten minutes ago, but uh, no, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm first, captain, I guess. No, I'm the first mate. The first just, mate I'm, just try, I'm, try, I'm trying to get into character. All right. Oh. Uh, right. You'll find a variety of tools and weapons in the armory. Uh, All right. Located on the starboard side of the ship. Cool. I'm uh, I'm getting I'm I'm getting into I'm I'm getting into my like suit, which is like a like I'm trying to think. I want to think what I want this to be. It's like a it's like a, it's like a Starcraft to like space marine suit, but it's like maroon red. Yeah. And I got and because we're conducting business with got a little tie. With the mob, yeah. It, no, it's not going to have a little tie. It's going to have a big tie. Because people uh, got to know I'm big man with big ideas and big dreams. So I'm going to put a big tie. Uh, yeah, actually, I'm, no, I'm not wearing my military suit. I'm wearing my, it's a, it's still a mech suit, but it's a big, like, zoot suit with shoulder pads made out of metal. And I got a tie. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, and I uh, got nice boots and shoes and nice red metal pants. I'm a big man with big dreams. I got a nice red tie. It's all so red. Just to be clear, you're in a essentially a power armor zoot suit. Yes, and I got a yeah. I got glasses too. I'm gonna put glasses on. I walk out to Tom and I'm like, "What do you think?" Uh, uh Stephen, run a atmospheric and uh, climatological scan on the planet, please. Yes, sir. Hey, when, I'm asking a question. Wait. That's <laughs> fine. Loading. I take it by ear. Just make it sure you're going to be warm, sir. It's uh, a temperate climate. That's uh, a good idea. It's just leaving its winter season. Uh, well, I love the, the area winter. you'll be l landing in is actually rather idyllic. Some nice fields, a couple forests, uh, small amount of gang activity. <laughs> 
Oh, by the way, when you mentioned winter, I immediately went back in the armory and I got a big, like, mech sized, you know, like Bane's coat. I got an that. even bigger mechanical parka. Yeah, yeah yes. <laughs> now I'm wearing a Bane coat over my zoot suit. And it's, I'm like, I'm all. Uh, sir, do you think you might be too warm? I never get too warm because I can yes, do this. I press a button and a flap where my butt is opens up, and it's just my butt because I didn't put on underwear. I'm like ah, feel that nice space breeze, that solar wind on your twin moons. That's the ventilation system, sir. This guy knows what I'm talking about, right? I like nudge Thalman. Like yeah, this guy knows. <laughs> uh, Steven, why are we the only two people on this ship? Because we're best buds. Sir. Two captains running the same ship. It's like we're married. It's great. Uh, you you are a you are a duo that has worked together in the past. Usually, uh, you've been apart for a while, so you may have forgotten how zany he is. Can I uh, can I make an investigation check to see if I'm wearing a wedding ring? You may. And, <laughs> and if James is also wearing a ring. <laughs> if we're a double husband out and counter power couple, that's good. please. Dude, I'm gonna make an investigation. Go for it. What you got? I'm just going to roll a 20, I guess. Yeah. I'm going to roll a 20 D. Just let me know what you got. I got a 1. James, what'd you get? Hold on. I got a 14. I got a 14. James? Uh Uh-huh. You two are totally a couple. Yes! Oh, my God. You you are a bachelor for life. As far as you're aware. You Man, forgot me that you got married. <laughs> what? This is great. It's my space. I need you to kick you in here. Yep. You think uh, you're single and ready to mingle. Isn't it great? Two two husbands. Two guys in business. Two partners in business and life. It's great. Uh, I love you. Um, uh, you're, yeah. Did you hear me? I said I love you. I said I love you. Yeah, I, I got that. Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> uh, We're reaching the planet in 15 minutes. Yeah. Is there, wait, is there any way they could, like, detect us from, uh, from, like, orbit? You know? Yes. Hmm? Oh, no. Uh, the How? local government has already detected you, and I sent forward, I I've took the liberty of forwarding your travel details and uh, access, uh, gaining access to a landing field. If the government knows, the local gang may know as well. That's what we call not optimal. That's fine. I took you the want... liberty of also using one of the fake names for the ship. All right. Fake registration codes, just in case. I mean, may as well, like, land this thing, right? Isn't that right, honey? <clears throat> I, I inch away. <laughs> okay. like some five feet or so. Yeah, yeah. Wait, where are, where are we right? Right now, I'm, I'm imagining, like, I'm imagining like John is in like the captain's chair, like actually doing shit. I'm just kind of like walking around the deck, like just talking, basically just to myself. Uh, like are we at the break or yeah, like what? So if captain's chair would be like right here, and you'd be like right here. Wait, are you like gesturing to something? Hold on. I'm on the I'm on the screen. The yeah. I didn't see that as well. We might have to refresh. Oh, shit. Oh, hold on. I wasn't even looking at the roll 20 screen. Oh, God. Just wait. Refreshing. All right. All right. Do it again. Sorry. So. You are right here. And John is right here. Fair enough. John? I'll get rid of it. No, that, that wasn't it. James? 
I was using I was using it to signal which ones you were. That was that wasn't me admonishing you. All right. Jeez, pings. <laughs> All right. Let's uh I guess uh, we just end, right? Yep. You come in for a landing. And uh <sighs> What does it look like? What are we seeing out our viewport as we descend down the gangplank? What do we see? Out your viewport. You got you're in this it's kinda of like Moss Isley's uh okay. landing thing with the big rings where the ships land in. Yeah. Um with passages leading towards the customs office uh -huh. and out into the city. Or the town or what what have you. They uh got the customs office over here and path to the city over here uh, all right you, you currently you guys in the bridge are facing the far wall uh-huh and uh it'd be to the back if you head to the back of the ship it's in that direction where the uh customs office in town are Too lit. Oh, too city. <laughs> too litty. I thought it was too litty. Too litty uh, it's 421 here now. Oh, Actually, it's 214 here. Oh, boo. All Wait, right. How many, how many places have that date set up of 24? Uh... Pretty much everywhere but the United States. I was going to say basically, like, yeah, right? Japan doesn't year. A month, I think. Hmm. We're the only one to get 420, bitches! That's pretty cool. Snoop Dogg's gonna visit all the good kids tonight. <laughs> Hooray! <clears throat> Alright, is there, like, when we walk, so... Is I imagine, it's... like, we walk down the gangplank. Yep, you head down like, the gangplank. Is there anything I can see, like, anything we can see where it's, like, obviously this is the way to go, like... Well, there's exactly two places to go. Anything that looks odd? Is there anyone, like, hanging out? Because uh, like, there is... Moss Isley, they were all, always, like, people there hanging around. There is one shady character kind of, kind of, kind of hanging out by the tunnel you know? towards the city. Is there anyone like that? Yeah, there's exactly one uh, on in the landing area. Uh, he's hanging out, kind of kind of looking shifty over by the... Yeah, right, the green dot. And, uh... There's also a guy by the customs office who's ha who, uh... seems to be looking at you very intently. So, uh, what you, what you gonna do, James? John? What you, uh, where are you gonna go? I'm gonna let James make the call on this one. What you thinking, James? Dead man. Here's his cone of vision. <laughs> hey, James? James? Okay, well, I guess I, uh... <laughs> I guess you're going. I guess James I'll go. Died. I'll go talk to Mr. Shady Face over here. All right. So uh, you approach him, and he realizes you're approaching him, and like looks down at his clipboard and starts just like scribbling away at it. It's, like he glances up from it and again glances away guiltily. Hail, fair gentle. Ah. Ah, Say I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. I was getting turned around because I okay. What I'll say is I I broke for the one dude by the door, and I I was striding confidently because I thought uh, Tommen was behind me, but then I noticed that he definitely was not. So I got like really turned around the boss, and I saw him, and just was like ah there he uh, is. You ah. right. the clipboard yells too. Hey, uh, what's up? Uh, we're hu uh, we're hus uh, we're. We're husband and wife, and we're husbands in in business and in life. What's up? Uh, no, nothing, sir. Just doing my job. 
uh, taking notes, uh, for, for the, for the office. Uh, do you have anything to declare, sir? Are you bringing any, uh, any, uh, any cargo in? I'm Not bringing it's going to stay here. Uh, very good. Very good. Wait. And, uh, oh, um, <laughs> uh, um, did, did, what, what, what is your purpose here again? Well, really quick, I'm not going to lie. I got some heavy baggage, my guy. I got some uh, heavy baggage. Uh, you know uh, why? He's really close why? to the Olympic limit of 70 kilograms per bag. I He's, he's yeah. right in the line there. I mean, no. he, he, he may be, but it's it's not a public transport. This is your own private transport, so you can break it as much as you'd like. No, no, listen, listen. I got I got some real heavy baggage because and I wrap my arm around John because I love this man so much. And I know deep down, even though he never vocalizes it, like ever, I, I don't think I've ever heard him say it once. I know that he loves me, you know? Uh, I love you. I, I, I don't know, sir. I'm I, I'm not talking I'm not, to you. I'm yes, talking sir. to this guy. I'm talking oh, to John. Right, sir. I so, my well, why aren't you talking to this guy? He seems like a perfectly good gent. Like, what's wrong with it? Why can't you love this man? I, 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 I love, because I love you. Because I love you. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> See? What a guy. What a cab. And I ruffle his hair. And I'm like, yeah. Uh, what, were, what were we doing here again? What was what are we talking about? Baggage? We're on vacation. Oh, yeah. We're on vacation. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, uh, I, we, we, we log, uh, all of our, all ship incoming and outgoing data, and we thought we used ship matched, uh, one we'd seen previously, uh, a couple of bounty hunters working for the government, but it, is, it, ah. it appears we're mistaken. <laughs> Yeah, we bought this used at a garage sale like three three weeks ago, three space um, weeks ago. Yeah. Yes, it, it is about guess, that time of year. We changed out licenses. We'll have to get to that after our trip. Well, ha have a good day, sir. Uh, sorry to bother you. You as well. Keep doing your job. You're yeah. great at it. Uh, Thanks, thank man. You. Thank you. Uh, I want you both to roll perception. Do we have modifiers on that? Uh, we're gonna go with you. Yes, roll perception, but roll at disadvantage. So roll twice to take the lowest number. I'm gonna roll. Can I roll my twenty D that yeah, I just have here? Yeah, roll okay. the D twenty. And uh, did you roll two eighteens? Oh shit! <laughs> James, what'd you roll? I rolled a two. Okay. So. Uh, <laughs> John, you notice. What do I? You notice that the dock worker has quite okay. has uh taken some credits off of James, and uh attempted to do the same to you. Is it this one, or yeah, that one. I'd like to confront him. Like, uh, hey, 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 friend. This uh, is part of your job. I, I didn't I didn't do anything. Take those credits off my companion here. Wait, what what's credits? going on? As he, he throws up his hands, he's like, what credits? And they fall to the ground. Whoa. Hey, Close wait a minute. Ways. Dude, wait, that, that's a lot of cash. Where'd you get that from? It was my birthday. Oh, it's his birthday. Did you hear that? It's his birthday. Happy birthday. Thank that's you. Cool. How old are you? Uh, 25 standard galactic years what are you doing working on your birthday that must be hard to fit on a cake 25 standard galactic years but you know what that's fine that's cool i'm uh, happy I, I have to make money somehow that's fair how are you gonna afford all those letters for that cake you know yep yep gotta 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 get that cake yes if you're cool with this i'm not gonna do anything about it so cool with what what are you talking <laughs> Where do you, he where do you get those the, off of you? Well, he, said he, he says these credits were for his birthday, right? Yep, yep. I, I got them <laughs> for my birthday for, from from letters, from, from relatives. Because, you know, here. like, it'd be really bad if it, like, you know, it's one thing lying about stealing money, but it's another thing lying about a birthday. Oh, that, I never, sir. That's something I can't excuse, yeah, especially. Uh, I'm going to need to see some ID. 
Uh, you, you actually, don't under... actually have the authority to do that, sir. No, we're, we are undercover Galactic Federal agents. Uh, you right now. Yeah. Um, uh -huh. I'm gonna have to Wait. ask you to verify with my supervisor. I'll be I'd happy like to tell your supervisor ID. that you tried to steal from us. I'd like to see your proof. Uh, yeah. I, 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 think, a... I think you're trying to yeah, steal right from me. Wait, but one uh, place my... like this have cameras or something? We're right there. We got one on our ship. Yeah. We can just go check that ship camera. Give us our money back and this can all go away. Actually, yeah. Wait a minute. I'm sensing something sinister here. Something tells me you're not 25. You, you got me, you're sir. I, I, older. I, I lie a little bit to make people feel better for me. You're I, an old man. God damn, you're, you're aging before my eyes. It's like that scene in that Indiana Jones movie. In, Holy in crap. Movie? You lied about your birthday. No, sir, it is my birthday. You could be lying about the credits. Which is weird because you have the exact number of credits that I now realized I have missing from my space wallet. That's weird. It is. Well, the world is full of strange coincidences. Goodbye, friend. <laughs> oh, have a nice day. Have a good day. <laughs> uh, <coughs> uh, you guys turn around. Yeah. You went away. <laughs> he quickly scoops the credits up off the ground and books it. In John, do you office. actually, like, this is out of character, obviously. John, do you actually want to do anything about that, or is, like... <laughs> if you don't care, then I don't care. All right, fair enough. I don't want to, like, I don't want to, like, override or steer too much. I don't want... Not like we have hard and fast rules set for us anyway. Like, yeah. we don't even have cheats, so... That's fair. All right. Uh, Intangible anyway. Are we just, are we just heading out into the city then, I guess? Yep, That's and, probably... uh... As you head towards, as Wait, you head towards you have to check in with the customs office, or what's that? That was that was sufficient. You didn't actually okay. have to check in with anything. That was just him being a dick. And uh, you know, for being nice, I guess. <laughs> as you head towards the tunnel into the city, you notice the uh, the shady the guy who was kind of shady over there. He's gone. Uh, he's not there anymore. I'm saying I was looking forward to meeting him. Oh my god. Oh well. They can teleport here. That's crazy. And, uh, this tunnel's uh, like... Uh, this tunnel's like a hundred feet long. There's no way you can run out of here. That's, that's pretty nuts, dude. <laughs> I see no footprints. So he teleported. That's it's, it. It's stone, James. There won't be footprints. Nah. There's always footprints. Dust foot. foot cosmic foot. You know what I mean. Captain, uh, not captain, sorry, second captain. Aha. It's a city with paved roads. There won't be Aha. footprints. Oh, I forgot. We brought Steven with us. Uh, I'm on your communications, yes. Hey, Steven. H Hello, Cap Steven, uh, wasn't it captain. crazy? That guy lied about his birthday. Yes, his birthday. That's what he lied about. That's so sad. I hope I never have to lie about my birthday. I hope you never have to lie about anything. Because I never lie about everything. Anything. I never lie about anything. He ever just, like, tries to get free desserts from restaurants by lying about his birthday? Maybe that... Wait, do you think that's what he was doing? Maybe he's trying to get free dessert from us. I don't know. That's sad. Free dessert? I have free dessert. I can barely afford food. So, or a second the city... There are a couple places you can go. There's a there's a bar right next door. Uh huh. Um. There is a yeah the bar. There is a dance club next door to that because you know one of them stays open longer than the other. Mhm. Mm and. A, you got a weapons shop to the to your right, bars to your left, the weapons shop to your right, and then next to the weapons shop is a, a little odds and ends market. Hmm. Uh, do we, 
are there are there any areas that like do we know what these gang members would look like like what kind of attire they wear or uh you can ask you can ask, ask your around. ai oh you shit yes yeah. or you can hey, ask around steven uh yes sir what what uh like what what do these guys look like this this aluminum no wait what is the name of this gang <laughs> i totally forgot uh the the gang that your target is uh hiding with is, according to police records is generally known for wearing navy blue and mm -hmm. uh black uh -huh. and they it's suspected, although not confirmed, that they run the weapons shop. Hmm. That's interesting. That's very there are interesting. Also, uh, they also have the, the lower before. level members hang out at the uh, dance club. And one uh, member who is suspected to be a high-ranking member has the VIP booth at the bar. Bar? There's a bar here? That's there what is that a bar is? here. It's oh to your gosh. left. I, I, I could go for a drink. Yeah, as you usually do. Well, how about you? I honey? can't drink anything. Not you, Steven. I don't call you, Sorry. honey, because I only have one man, one being in the whole universe to. And he's this man right here. Yes, sir. Uh, um. <laughs> I, I, I guess I guess we could go to the bar. I like it. To the bar. So you head to the bar. All right. And uh. Did you write Calvin was here? <laughs> John did. <laughs> That's good. Um. H. Uh, what's what's the building with the H again? That's a uh, hotel. I'm just taking notes here. And, uh... That's fine, because that's going to be a minute to draw. building the map as we go. It's fun. <laughs> Spontaneous generation. So you walk into the bar. And so this, number... you have a long face. <laughs> uh, it's got a number of booths. In the back right is the VIP area with a cordoned off. That's cordoned off with a scary looking bouncer. This one? Hold on. That one, yes. And then this is the bar itself. With the bartender back there making drinks, serving customers. The, the, there is a jukebox playing out some songs. Dude, Archie, that looks like a dick. Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha, Freud loves you, James. I know. Yes, I know. Because the Bible tells me so. <laughs> jukebox over here playing the music next to the door. <laughs> What is, what is the rest of that word? Oh, there it is. Penis. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> My God, look at those giant floating letters that just appeared in the sky. What could it mean? It's an advertisement. It's an advertisement for male enhancement pills. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, it's, it's actually a booming... Uh, this this planet is known for its male enhancement pills. That's... It's, it's one of the main manufacturers of ma male enhancement pills. Oh, my God. Yeah. I mean, what? You just bunny porn. What? 
Are you guys t- out, out of game right now? Have you guys heard of Bunny Coin? No. <laughs> I feel like I have. Crypto specifically for the adult industry. Really? <laughs> cool. Why? The idea is that apparently that you like buy it when you pay for your smut. Um, it's not as easily traceable to you. Hmm. I guess. I, I, I just think the whole thing's ridiculous, but... Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. Ridiculous. Ridiculous when, you know... You can still buy physical magazines with cash. But now, now you can do it with a quick one if you look cool in 2018. Fair enough. <laughs> okay, back to the action. Back to the action! So you walk in. It's actually, uh, it, it's about midday, so it's not hopping too much. There are a couple of patrons in there. Bartender is uh, doing his thing, washing the same glass over and over as every good bartender does. Ride on you. And the uh, bouncer's kind of just leaning against the wall, not uh, not really paying attention. I don't want to go up to the bartender. It's saunter up. In my bane coat over my suit suit with a cigar. Oh, your roast mechanical my... bane coat over your heart your uh Oh no the bane coat's on the, the, the bane coat's not mechanical. Oh it's, it's not? It's, it's just a massive bane coat, yeah. Okay. But I saunter up. I'm like I just thunk one of my big arms on the table, I'm like You look like a good person. And a good person well, give me and my husband here free drinks. Or drinks at reduced price. Let's negotiate up from free. Sir? Uh-huh. You have five seconds to get your arm off my bar before I pull a shotgun on you. A shotgun? And it's That's... not the name of a drink. Oh, man. Is it a way to deliver a drink? Like some kind of shotgun stein? You're going to wish it was. Okay. I can see where this is going. Uh, I grab, I grab the bartender by his face. <laughs> you grab the bartender by his face. Yeah, I grab my big hand around his face. Sir, please let go of my face. And I throw him. And you throw the bartender. I throw the bartender. Give should I roll? roll for? Yeah, give should me I roll. roll? For... <laughs> roll for initiative. No, just give me a strength check first. I got a nine. <laughs> so you kind of pull the bartender forward, but he's still behind the bar. All right. Because he, he's uh, fighting you. Sir, hmm. huh. this is your final warning. Let go of my face now, or there will be consequences. Can I try it again? You're more than welcome to try. I got uh That's a seven. That's a... <laughs> hey. Chuko, and uh, Chuko, the bouncer walks over. This is okay, a big dude. Ask if that was a racial slur. What? I was about to ask if that was a racial slur or something. No, that's his name. His name's Chuko. He's from. He's a. He's a very large guy. Like a. Uh, he's got pale blue skin, like real pale, like super pale. Huge, uh-huh. fucking jacked, like, and he's a. Uh, He's like eight feet tall. Yeah, boss. Oh, my God. Uh. Uh, you're gonna. Ha- can you uh? Can you please remove this man from my face? I take out. The- I take out. I take out my giant, uh, revolver, my pistol. I'm like, Chuko, All I want is a free drink. I also want to sell something to the mob, or I want them to sell something to me. But I want a free drink first. That's important. I don't want to kill you. I don't want to kill your boss, but I will. Chuko I laughs see. and uh, says, "That's not how things work around here, stranger. You All gotta, right, I want to. You gotta be a paying customer before the bosses start to uh, give you favors. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do one, 
more check and see. To throw the bartender? This would, me, this would be attempting to throw. This would be like picking up the bartender and like throwing him into Chuko. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on. And hook. God damn it. It's a six again. It's a six. The bartender shifts a bit and Chuko laughs again. And then uh, roll for initiative. Ugh. 17. Got a 17. Mm -hmm. Oh, whoops. All right. John, what'd you get? You got a six. Oh, 16. 16. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got a 9, 17, 16, 17. All right. So the bouncer goes first, goes first, goes first, and swings to smack the gun out of your hand. Uh, he misses. He whips. Ha! James, I'm go. Gonna, I'm going to try throwing the bartender at him again. <laughs> I really want to Strength support. check. Strength check? Yeah. There's one left. Right, three, two, come on. Come on. 17 again. 17. Okay. You managed to actually lift the bartender over the bar this time and throw him towards Chuko. Uh -huh. But, uh, Chuko catches him and sets him down gently. Damn it. Damn it. Uh, John, what are you going to do? Um, question. Yes. I, I think I'm going to, uh, going to hold my action. Okay. What happens next? So I can react if needed. So if you just wait, uh, the part bartender then uh, dusts himself off a little and pulls a pistol out of his pocket. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, he's going to attack James. Whew. And misses. Ha! Ha! Shot whizzes I... past you and hits the wall. Oh my god, wow, dude. Does it the like other, hit the other bar pat patrons? A uh, couple, two or three of them that were in here just kind of run, like walk out. Does it wait? Does it so when he whiffs and it, the bullet impacts on the bar behind, is it like shattering a bunch right. of like really fancy so, liquor bottles or something? No. So you, mm -hmm. James, uh huh, are right here. Gotch. Gotcha. John is next to you. Okay. The bartender got thrown over here, and Chuko's right here. All right. So the bar, the liquor bottles are all to your left, their right. Oh, okay. And he just hits the wall behind you. All right. All right. I reach out behind me, and in classic fashion, I pull out my, like, chain gun thing. I, again. I, I, I don't heat. I, I like start to heat it up. I'm like, listen, guys, this thing's got a big spread. I don't want to cause any damage. But, you know, I just want a free drink. It could have been a shot. It could have been a water, you know? Why didn't you say so, the bartender I, says. I said free drink. I said I wanted a free drink. You Preferably didn't awesome. specify. God damn it. God You're not wrong. <laughs> uh, Chuko uh, pulls out a re fairly large looking gun of his own and goes to shoot you, James. And you whiffs. tackle James to the ground. Uh, so you're going to tackle James to the ground as he does this? John? Okay, so you do that. Uh, give me a strength check. Oh. Ooh. So you bump into James. And kind of, like, fall on him. Oh, God. Oh, honey, are you okay? Oh, my God, I'm so sorry. The shot still misses both of you, and nobody gets you... hit. Listen, I just wanted it. I feel like with, like... Would any of the if the boss guy is there? Wait, no, 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 
I'm going to say, hey, listen, if the boss guy's here, I just want to talk to you, you know? He's not. I don't want to. I don't. He's, he's not, not here. No, it's he's, the middle of the day. Why would he be of, here? What kind of mob boss doesn't day drink? What kind of mob boss day drinks when he's got work to do? What work? Isn't it like smuggling rifles and what like work Chinese What does mob do during the day? Yeah, what does a mob do during the day? I don't know. I just serve the liquor. Hmm. Don't, don't go preach at, uh, at us about how we don't know how the mob works when you assume that they're working during the day, because that well, makes no sense. Well, they're clearly not here. God damn it. Mm. This has been a fruitless encounter. Uh, uh, <laughs> the, <laughs> the bartender is about to shoot again. Did you? Wait, god damn it. 18. I'm just out of here. Wait, uh, we're James. leaving. Uh huh. I like to no. I like to think. Okay, John's character, Thomas, is like tugging mine James, back. James took and one actually, damage. Okay, How he's actually that means he's like pulling me out of the door of the bar and like in spite the bartender just like fires off a shot. He like gets me in the arm. I'm like God damn it! Ow! Fine, we're going. Christ! And I pop my head back. back in. I pop my head back in. I'm like so like. There's a, another shot hits the wall next to you. Okay, <laughs> thanks. <laughs> uh, all right, and you know what? Good. Good work. Uh, okay. So that wasn't optimal. That wasn't. That wasn't. I apologize. Um, oh, we're not dead, to be honest. We are not dead. Yeah, after years of pulling this shit. <laughs> Do you want to, uh, I don't know. The snowman. You want to do that right now? We quickly hike up to the nice rural pastoral part <laughs> of this region. Okay. And we, we, we stay, this is a montage, like, set to, like, wham. And we Pick stay. Me up for a <laughs> go, go. Don't leave me hanging on like a yo, yo. We stay in a nice, like, cozy little winter cabin. You do realize summer. it's spring, right? A nice <laughs> winter cabin. I make winter happen. <laughs> we make it happen with, with our love. And everyone else is like, oh my god, it's global warming. But it's like, no, it's just love. Um, what the fuck? And we make it happen. <laughs> and we stay there for about a week. And then we come back down. We're all rosy-cheeked. A little, wind, a little wind-worn, a little wind -worn. Well, I'm like, I'm really glad you suggested that. I really needed that. I think James has just uh, begun writing his own erotic novel right now. I, I'm not writing that. I lived it. I lived it. I really needed that. All right. Wow, man. I hope this guy didn't move in the week we were gone. <laughs> it's crazy. We came back at like the exact same time of day. <laughs> it's nuts. <laughs> It's actually closer to, like, early evening. The exact same time of day. Um, yes, sir. Uh, Bridget <laughs> clock. <laughs> it turns out, like, my mission clock is, like, way off because I insist that whenever I come back to somewhere after I've left, it's the same time as when I had left originally. So my mission clock says it's, like, one in the morning when it's clearly like like 11 or whatever i mean all right hey you want to go to the bar <laughs> uh i think we've had enough of that place yeah you're right what are you thinking what are you thinking probably uh, if I may... Get some, uh, get some accommodations at that hotel there. But yes, Steven, what do you got to say? Uh, this is, this is Steven in the week you were gone, they scheduled... Uh, I've been trying to monitor communication channels, and it, appear there's going, it appears there's going to be a large gathering in the hotel ballroom for an uh, unspecified reason. Hmm how socially awkward we are, that would probably be a bad move on our part to attend. Wait, is it like so, a quinceanera? 
Unfortunately, no. Make a bar mitzvah. It appears, I believe it to be the gang about so to sell the information to the highest bidder. It's not a cultural coming of age ceremony for a young child. No. <laughs> gang members, specific, but... Those are the best places. Gang to members. Those, those, gang those members. Are... G- yeah, dead, dead. Gang members have been seen coming in and out of the hotel over the course of the last week. Were they wearing yarmulkes? <laughs> no. Are you sure? Fairly certain. Okay. Yarmulkes haven't been invented yet. And none of them look like what? They were. <laughs> Wait a minute. We've gone so far forward. We're in the past. It's before Judaism ever existed. <laughs> This is the future of the past. The past future. All right. Future past. That's not a bad name for a band or a show. Here we go. Um, there all right. There's a series called Tales of Future Past. Uh, pff, as long better. as you don't call it Days of Future Past. It's already been Future done. Um, all right. I mean. That's what I was thinking of. Listen, I mean, may as well go go to the. It could still. May as well go to the bar, I guess. Yeah, he's right to the bar. <laughs> you we, go back I to the walk, bar. I we walk in. I'm like, oh man, there's a bullet hole. Before we bar. walk in, I slap a false mustache on James. <laughs> like, hello everybody, recognize me? Or what? No, I say like, what's up? We're back. Before. We're back. To... Good game. Ames and I, uh, there, if, as you walk in, you notice uh, there's a picture of you behind the bar. Uh-huh. With a note underneath that says, Do not enter. Kill on <clears throat> sight. Hey, Thomas. I'm... Yeah. Listen, I grew up in the digital age. My mom didn't have... She bought audiobooks. I don't know how to read. What does that say? <laughs> does it... Employee of the month. Oh my god! I only worked here like 10 minutes and I punched the bartender! Huh. Are you gaining respect in this industry? I'm very happy! The service industry is a lot better than they told me. I should know, I used to work at a fry cook on a, on a Starliner. Those were the days. You ever had sex with a grease trap? Uh, no. It depends how, how you have a grease trap. Neither have I, because I'm so devoted to you. I'm just saying, I've I've seen a lot of good-looking grease traps in my day. I could have definitely strayed strayed the path, you know what I mean? Uh, Sir, is grease trap colloquialism? Huh? Are you (laughs) from Is grease trap a metaphor or a simile or some other usage of different words to indicate something else? I'm not legally allowed to talk about that. Under oath not to disclose I'm on, any I'm under oath. <laughs> the third dimensional judge told me I can't do that. Uh, sir? Do you know I have uh, access to your records? Brother is watching. Uh-huh. Hey, were you with us at the cabin? Technically. Because it was just supposed to be me and Thaman here. I heard everything. God damn Bush administration. Fucking, fucking Patriot Act bullshit. What is this? The Patriot Act of 532. I did not almost. Extensive. I did not almost fuck a seemingly infinite line of grease traps. So you still have a defined grease trap. <laughs> to be spied on by by my own computer. Whatever. Out of Ow. character. What the fuck does grease trap mean? I think it That's literally true. means grease. Does it literally mean grease trap? For me to you? No, you can find out. Okay, back in character. Uh, back in character. Uh, Are we learning that James is an awful racist? <laughs> out of character. Turns out grease traps are uh, rather diminutive. Are, are rather is the uh, derogatory term for a rather diminutive species that tends to only find work in uh, fast food joints. <laughs> There's a whole yeah, I like that. There's a whole species that just works in fast food joints. That's all the job they can get. And my God. God. Uh, the bartender and bouncer both uh, look up and notice you guys come in. Hello. You again. No, that was. Oh, no, no, no. 
It's only yes. been a week. We are tourists Please. from from New Russia. You know the place they took big parts of old Russia and they put it on a planet. That's roll, New Russia. Roll, uh, roll deception checks. That's where we're uh, from. I got a twelve. Got a ten. All right, and uh... it's risky, yeah. Hmm. Uh, oh no. <laughs> oh, oh comrades, welcome. The bartender oh. loves you guys now. He is. I I carefully read the bouncer's a little suspicious. I carefully readjust my mustache because it's like slipping off a little bit. So I'm just like, ah, yes. Hello. Come tell me, how it is the motherland? It's so good to see you. Hello. Yeah. I believe it's all. It's an old New Russia custom <laughs> to give to give free drinks to old friends from old New Russia. <laughs> it is so glad you remember. <laughs> Good day to follow the old traditions of old New Russia. Here, Very let me give you a shot of this brand spanking new shipment of the uh -huh. most delicious vodka from old New Russia. I love old He's New Russia best. vodka. It tastes like old, but it's new, you know? It's yeah. Nice. It's updated. It's good. We drink. We be. We make merry. You this is, You drink with me. This is my husband, uh, Fominsky. Yes. Fominsky. Oh, oh what a good old Russian good. name. Fominsky. <laughs> <laughs> I am Pietrusky. Piet Pietr. Very nice to meet you, Pietrusky. I might to say, oh my god, I'm slipping in like a Borat. My wife, uh, oh. uh, uh, Tell me, happy. how is the Zara? Is she it, good? The Zara, I do yes. not get much news from the homeland. She's dead. No! She died. You see the Russian revolution? <laughs> yeah. Uh. It turns out people do not like old new Russian traditions. They want the new new Russian traditions. No, 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 like, Russia traditions. Yeah, no, I was like, no, 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 oh, no. no. And, I, and then I left. <laughs> we, will not, we will have to That's drink not... in memory of the Sara. She was beautiful, Wait. like spring flower. Yes. Uh, she uh -huh. uh, at this point, uh, <laughs> I come, uh, uh, sirs. The uh -huh. Zara looked like a pig that had been defaced by a meat grinder. That's the American football. Yes. <laughs> yes, come, we come. Have, 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 the, have the shot. I, yes. Sirs, if you drink that alcohol, it may kill you. <laughs> I don't know English. <laughs> I speak. <laughs> I take the shot. Wait, no. No, we have to toast. We have to you, toast to something. You, we toast to the old mother Russia. To the old long new, maybe she survive. The old damn new space mother Americans. Russia. Yes, damn the space Americans. Drink. We drink. I drink. We, we drink. And, uh, I'm going to need you to both give a constitution roll. Hold on. That doesn't count. Okay. That's a, that's a D29. I rolled a 17. Uh, I got a 20. John, <laughs> you weren't even phased. You're ready for more. James, what'd you get? 17. I rolled uh wait, let me try again. Hold on, it was kind of bad. Dun, da, da, da. I rolled a- wait, no, I rolled a 3. I'm changing my roll to a 3. Nope, it's a, a 3. Four. Uh, James? I'm sorry, Jay. Uh -huh. Don't give it to him. Give it to me. You're calling the 17 him. first. <laughs> give, him the, give him the 17. All right, He's fine. He's first. You, yeah, we're going with the 17. James, you're ready for your. It, it was a little rough, but you're ready for another one. <laughs> and now He's... we drink to the Zara. Beautiful the Zara. summer flower that she was. And he pours out another shot. Summer flower, yes. It tastes like sucking dust from Spaceship Tailpipe. I love it. Reminds me of home. Oh, those right. were the days as a child. 
I rolled an eleven on this next. Uh, uh, okay. I rolled I rolled a fifteen. No, we're going with three. Okay. <laughs> uh, Do I just job. like vomit up the like blood? The second one <laughs> second one isn't as good. Uh, you, just... you don't really want the third one. Oh, nah, you pass out. Like home. You cough, you vomit a little bit, and you pass out. Oh no, I threw up my cigar. Hold on. I, I gingerly pick my cigar up, brush the vomit off, I stick it back in, then I pass out. I'm like, oh, <laughs> just like home, pass out. <laughs> oh, and now we toast to him. Now we toast to him. Uh, another shot. I'm like face down at my vomit, is what I'm going to say. John? My cigar is my cigar still puffing. Ten twenty eight ten. <laughs> God damn it! What oh, champ? You know you weren't sure after the second shot, but the third shot, you're feeling great again. Down you, like water. Like what? Like air? It just—it's nothing. That's so. it. Mm. No. At this point, the bouncer comes up and hits you in the back of the head. Can I make uh, another constitution saving throw? Yeah, make the constitution saving throw. Yeah, you're fine, actually, because he rolled a one. Sick. So, uh... Sick. He misses, because but, uh, you duck down to vomit. Uh, t t you pass out. Okay. Dun dun dun. And this has been so far. <laughs> <laughs> when you guys wake up, you're out back. Go, go. Tied up, leaned against a wall. Okay. The, uh, bartender and the bouncer are there. Ah, oh, friends, you wake up, yeah? Ah! Uh, 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 he's oh good! He's good! Yeah. <laughs> As... Oh, welcome! I, I, staggered so to the, I staggered to my feet, I got my arms like out, I'm like, Oh, that breath of right there, give me space! And then I suck on my cigar. <laughs> ah, my As God. Chuko reminded me, you were the customers from last week. Uh, no, 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 no. We no, were from no, New no, Old Russia. No, you no, put a one straight, over on me, damn space a, Americans. A stray ember remembers. A stray ember wafts up from my cigar and lights the mustache on fire, <laughs> and it just like turns to ash and it falls off my face. But I'm See? still doing the act. I'm like. I'm like, I no, no. You so you are a space Americans. No, you don't understand. It is cause it is new fashion to wear a fake mustache. He's not. Oh, he got me. <laughs> He's right. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I'm gonna talk like this because I want to relate to you on a human level. You know, it's like if you if you ever talk like how you're used to, maybe we'll connect. I feel like we're connected. Oh, you fed me fucking space fuel. Space fuel make best vodka. Every tour. Old new Russian knows this. Now. I have it. half a mind to kill you right now. Wait. I fucking hate wait. you. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh. One. Thank you for the free drink. Very kind. I didn't get that from the old bartender. I had to almost beat the I crap am out the of the same bartender. Oh my god! A Russian replacement bartender installed by the American CIA to be uh, able to our cause. No, I don't recognize it. I'm gonna say, uh, anyway, thank you for free drink. Very kind. Uh, second, uh, you know, we just want to meet with the mob boss, you know? Well, good, because here he comes. Oh boy. He tell me I'm not to kill you till after he talk to you. Haha, <laughs> kill? <clears throat> I know what I said. 
Uh, mob boss comes up. Now, I hear you've been messing with my bartender. I hear you've been treating him not so good. Why do you do this to me? Why do you do uh, this to me? Well, we want to sell he works weapons. Hard. He w Shh, I'm talking now. You will get the chance to speak. He works hard, day in, day out. Provides for the family. Keeps Chico employed. Chuko, sorry Chuko, my apologies. <laughs> he keeps Chuko employed. He lets me drink. He lets me bring my friends. He gives me the best tables. If you were my friends, I could help you. But I have to keep him happy too. Give me a reason why I don't let him kill you. You may talk now. Uh, well, uh, we, we haven't exactly had the chance to become your friends because this is the first we're meeting you. So, uh, yeah. yeah. Not fair. Like, we don't have a fighting chance here, you know? Listen, listen, I'm, I'm going to, oh, we start off on the wrong foot. I'm Tommen. This is my husband, my partner in life, and my partner in business, Thomen, who loves me. It's nice Isn't to meet right? you. It's nice to meet you. Wait, are, you is, this, is this mob boss, like, devilishly, is he handsome, like, ruggedly? And, like, he's a the weird... godfather. So he's handsome? Sure. I so is John's, is John's character then, like, attracted to him? That's up to John. Um, John, do you want to be attracted to this man? We'll see. I don't think I'm... Uh, I'm going to suppress those feelings either way right now, because... <laughs> kind of in a situation. Yeah. Alright. Listen, I can get you out of this jam. But you gotta give me something to work with. Yeah, we can sell. We can. We can sell weapons. We gotta meet with one I of gotta, your guys. I got people that do that. No, but we got good I got weapons. people that sell weapons. We got government issue weapons, buddy. Uh, Nobody uh, wants government issue weapons. Why? They're not as good. Don't why? you know how the government works? If the government was good, why would I be in business? Hey, man, did you like forget your inhaler or something that you're? Breathy. Are you? Are you, look. are you? Are you insulting me? No. I have Excuse extended this butt, into friendship, butt. and you are insulting me. Us and friends care about other friends' uh, health problems. I just want to know if you're okay. I'm fine. Do you want to puff on my cigar? No. I stick it in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you it's have offended good. me for the last time. I smuggled it in with my butt. <laughs> Sir. I will do nothing more for you. I gave you my butt cigar. Have a good life. For as long I as it lasts. And he leaves. Wait. As he's leaving, could I shoot him? No, Wait. your arm your arms are tied. They restrained oh. you. Oh no. Can this just be a story about how we failed to do the job? <laughs> <laughs> I think whatever we're at that happens. Point. <laughs> so uh <laughs> Chico and the bartender are about ready to, uh, and Pietrovsky, Pietrovsky are about ready to shoot you. Oh boy. Is there, uh, I'd like to think we were all just like staring at each other for a moment. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it's like, so. any last words, comrades? Before I put the put gun through your head. Thanks for you're gonna, you're gonna put the gun. My English not so good. Don't my my American is not so good. Don't insult me. I was just asking a, a question about logistics here. But no, nothing on you. I was just curious about your methods. Chuko Chuko teach me how to shoot well. We shoot you now. Yes? No. Oh, hold on there, oh. friend. Uh, so why, why don't we, uh, we make men somehow? What do you mean? Uh, let's say we play a friendly game of cards. Sir? Uh, yeah. 
Would you, uh, would you like me to activate operate, uh, your failsafe operations? Yes, one of those again. Uh, or bartender to say, but sure. <laughs> Uh, it's the AI. Um, the failsafe is I drop an escape pod around the two of you. If you crash the ship into the bar, crash the ship into the bar, ship into the bar, crash the ship into the bar. Do it. I'm just shouting that. I'm just shouting that. What I'm do like, you crash, mean, crash, crash ship into, into the bar? bar. Steven, oh, do it to my What? Expression. Don't worry about that. He's. Having a good time right now. Do it, do it, do it, do it. All day in our culture, we get a little whacked up on some controlled substances and then have a little fun. Crash, Steven, crash. As right you're arguing now. this, a pod drops down around the two of you. Oh, uh, not a pod. No, the whole ship. No, no, James, do you want to live? Uh, it'll, like, cra it'll land on them. <laughs> it'll land on you, too! I'm imagining it's, like, nose first. You know what I mean? Like crash is like nose. Still land on you. Uh, fine. And now the ship. So be it. Make it land on me. <laughs> <laughs> you kill me. Kill me. Kill me. Oh God. Go ahead. Go, my dudes. My dude. Okay. Well, that's odd. Did you roll a crit fail on ship crashing? No, I'm trying to move all the bits and pieces. Would that mean that it did a really good job at not crashing? It would just land safely on the roof. Boo. Blow it in the atmosphere. <laughs> and the ship crashes. Yes. Yes. For kill, don't you think? What? Nothing is ever overkill. Wait, are those guys dead? Yes. And it was. Oh, uh, they are. This is all destroyed. The bar is destroyed. The dance club is slightly damaged. And uh, the police are coming. You know what? Uh, I, I say we cut our losses. <laughs> say it might be time to go. <laughs> On the ship you destroyed. Wait, the ship's destroyed? Yes! Oh, it's not like impervious it to- It crashed! Bar. Into a bar? Yes! You told it to nosedive into the ground! I- I meant like- Gently. I, I thought it could sustain damage! Oh no! You thought it gets the planet! <laughs> did, did, did I kill Steven? Oh it's no! no. Sir, I made a backup. This is generally how your plans go. No, man. Steam, where, where's where's the nearest ship? Well, sp spaceport, right? It's at the spaceport. Hey, Thom, we I think... I don't like going to jail. There's a crater where the bar used to be, by the way, with bits of flaming metal. Were we, like, thrown out? Like, how does that... So you were in the pod, which is designed to survive various atmospheres because it's an emergency pod. Okay. So you guys are safe. You're fine. You got like thrown out of the out of the pit. See, does it fly? Not. Yeah, it's, no. <laughs> not particularly. It's. I like, can't say how no, this is pod racing. That would be an <laughs> inaccurate statement. Damn it! No. I mean, you're racing the debris out of the pit. All right. Uh. I say we make we break for the spaceport. So you guys head into the spaceport, try and find a uh, ship to steal. I guess. Yeah. Do do we see the clerk from earlier? Yeah, the clerk is running out towards the city, having heard the commotion. Face to see who runs fast. You're gonna what? Punch him in the face as he runs fast. Okay, give me a roll. Seventeen. <laughs> yeah, you punch him in the face. Just he falls flat on his back, totally winded. Happy birthday! Thanks. 
And then we continue on our merry way. <laughs> Are you going to go to the right or the left? The right. Okay, Port, is always, Port is always right. We're going to the right. And there is a beautiful, gorgeous, hot rod cruiser waiting for you. Is there another cruiser? What? It's like a small, shitty cruiser? Uh, not in this one. I like being the underdog. <laughs> Listen. Wait, 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 wait. I stop. I stop. Not, not in this port. Not in this port? Not in the port. Not in this uh, hangar. Because, like, listen, if people see us riding around and stuff like that, they're going to expect something out of us. You know? We can't surprise them. I mean, we will, but we'll surprise them with how bad we are. Check it, Check a different hangar. So we check a different... I, I mean, I again, I don't want to overload this, John. Where are you doing? Oh, go ahead. I All like, right. I like check a different plan. hangar. Better ship. All right, you can either... If you leave that hangar back to the main one, you can either go to the right to a different hangar... Right to a different hangar. Right to a port different is hangar. Always, port, port is always right. <laughs> oh, the red dead wall. <laughs> All right. Uh-huh. And, uh... Uh-huh. Or number two. So, you run into that one, and it's just... It's a box. It's a shitty box that's barely supported on its own legs. I love it. <laughs> It's home. <laughs> Quick, into the box. <laughs> uh, there, you go into the box. Yeah. And there are people inside the box. Hey, what's up? I don't know if you heard, but there's a terrorist attack. You got, we're evacuating people. You got to get out. Uh, what are you doing at our ship? Uh, we're evacuating people. We have to con we have to confiscate the ship to help evacuate people. We we didn't we're hear with... anything on the radio. We're with the government. You wouldn't. It hasn't reached radio yet. We're go we're gonna. We're I'd like to see you. some identification. I throw them out the ship. Okay, there. Ah, um, this is an emergency. This is no time of saving lives. So there are three people. Uh huh. Are you going to try and physically move all of them? I'm gonna move. Oh, yeah. telling you it's an emergency. We gotta go. Wait, Thalman, quick, mu muscle up to the cockpit and tip the ship. Op I'm gonna open the hatch. <laughs> we'll just drop them out. We'll like tilt it. You know what I mean? Yeah. I say that out loud. Uh, <laughs> sir, please, please stop. Get go. Push through. No, it's fine. We're inspecting the ship Sir, so we can confiscate halt. it. We will shoot. Shoot. I you... grabbed the first guy I see. Okay, that'd be the purple one. I grabbed Mr. Purple. Yeah. And I'm, I'm going to throw him out. All right, let's see what I do. I got a 15. You managed to shove him down the ramp. Hooray. All right, next he's up. He's standing Come at back. the bottom, bewildered, and is trying to figure out what, he's, what he should do next. I pick up the other. I pick up another guy. All right, I'm saving your life, buddy. Pal. Fuck, I got, a, I got a five. You got a five. You grab him, and he grabs you back. Uh, you're a little heavier than I expected. Just, just give me. The pink one begins okay. to like grabs a. I, the pink one grabs a wrench. I got a seventeen. So, so I, you throw the yellow one out the door. He lands in the dust. The I, pink one swings one. at you with a wrench. Uh, okay, so I gotta dodge. Can yeah. I dodge that or? Uh, or what? You he hits you. It. He oh, just god. hits you. He whacks you upside the head with a wrench. Oh my god! Wow, that hurt a lot more than I... you. You think you know how much something's gonna hurt, and then you find out You're how much. You're really it clocked. Ow! Oh, wait, does is Thaman up in the cockpit? Oh, or... he hears it. No, because because he can activate the ship until. Tilt, uh, yeah, tilt he, him out. John, you're up in the cockpit. James took like six two. damage from that, by the way. I don't know how much that tilt means, him. but you t you got tilt. hit pretty bad. Tilt him out. I'm like I'm like kind of shaky. I'm trying to regain my vision. I, I would like to tip the ship as planned. All right. Uh, give me a roll. Fifteen. The ship picks up and begins to tilt. Mm -hmm. uh, 
However, the pink guy is maintaining his footing, and the purple guy has jumped onto the ramp. God damn it. Retract the ramp! Retract like to it! Go to the cockpit and tackle the guy that's in the door right now. Pink guy. Alright. So you're gonna move and tackle the pink guy. And on the ramp. Oh, the guy on the ramp? The pink guy through the door out down the ramp. Okay. Uh gimme a gimme a roll. You don't move him. And uh <laughs> he goes to swing at you. And oh, no. misses. Okay, that kind of clears my vision because seeing someone try to hurt Falvin makes me really angry. So I... The purple gonna, guy has moved into the doorway. I'm gonna... Alright, I'm gonna pick up the pink guy and try and throw him at the purple guy. Give me a roll. Seven. Fuck. Oh no. Yeah, you kind of shift him closer to the door, but he does, <sighs> doesn't really throw him out. Like to leg sweep one of them. Give me a roll. Whichever one's closer. Uh, let me pink. Oh. 17, okay. He's flat on his face. And he hits the deck. He's just on the ground. He's, he's on like... the ground. He's trying to get up. Uh, purple guy comes in and tries to punch James in the face. Oh, God. And misses. He's, he's uh, still off balance trying to get into the tilting ship. I take the arm of the purple guy. I'm going to try and shove him out again. Fuck, it's a three. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, You kind of just move him a little bit. You, you like grab his arm and you just kind of shake it. <laughs> he's very confused. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! What are you do Why are you doing this to us? We need this for- We're saving you! <laughs> I as don't I'm feel trying, very safe! As, I'm trying to nudge him to the open hatch like 50 feet off the ground now. <laughs> We're saving oh, your whole lives! I'm gonna level with you guys. Here, real quick. In yeah. the midst of like tackling one of them. <laughs> our, our ship got destroyed, so we need a way off this planet. Then go buy tickets on a passenger ship. We're poor nah. cargo. I'm not no, trying. Gonna, I'm gonna try to go quick. I'm gonna try and throw him off again. Give me a roll. Sixteen. Purple's off. He falls <laughs> down the ramp. <laughs> He's going to at least have some very high medical bills. Bye bye. All right. Bye. Uh, All right. I'm gonna go. Again, take off. You take care of pink guy here. All right, Pinky. You're the one who hit me in the wrench. You hit me in the wrench. Oh, my God. I'm still disoriented. Ah. He to, he's gotten up at this point and goes to swing at you with the wrench again. Uh, he misses. Yeah. All right. I'm going to take him. It's an eight. Fuck. Uh, yeah, you just kind of grab onto him. All right. I'm going to ask you, can you please just get... If you jump now, you'll be fine. I Pro say, sir, I have never seen such behavior. Oh my god, you're definitely getting pushed down. Holy shit. Uh, he goes to swing at you again, but misses. God. I should be getting a liftoff process. Five. God damn it. Are you kidding me? You guys are, you guys are locked in an eternal struggle. <laughs> <laughs> you have made a nemesis this day. <laughs> Holy shit! You guys just can't hit each other. The ship's moving too much. All right, hold on. This is, I can feel it. Thir Thirteen. Uh, he's on the ramp. Okay. You got him onto the ramp. And the ship is like. I'd like to retract the ramp. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Stand in the doorway. He does not. So the ramp is retracting. He's at the very edge of it. And he's trying to get back on. Ha! <laughs> some down. James, you doing anything? 
Oh shit! Wait, is he not? Isn't it? Is he just gonna fall or hold on? Not I'm yet. Gonna... He's on the edge. <laughs> he's still trying to fight his way back on though. Like he's gonna... on the ramp and he's trying to walk back is, into the ship. Is there any loose something that I could pick up and throw at him? Actually, I I just closed the door. Oh wait, yeah, we could just do that. <laughs> we could have done that the whole time. <laughs> shit. So the door closes. Also, I'm noticing this, and then I I open uh. I push a I push a big red button on the side um, of the wall, what? and like a huge hole opens in the floor, where like they were all standing when we came in. I'm like, <laughs> oh man, that would have yeah, been really that was, that was if they had big cargo. That that was the big cargo door. Ah, uh, that you just opened. Uh, so you have yeah. control of the ship now. I suggest uh, you leave uh, the system. Two captains back at it again. <laughs> Captain Future Past. Two captains. Two. Coming this summer. Coming this summer. Two captains oh. as they explore the galaxy. I I kind of like trudge up into the into into the into the cockpit. I put my hand on John's shoulder, on thumb and show. I'm just like, you know what? <laughs> we made some good memories. I got I I like take out a, out a bunch of Polaroids <laughs> from the winter cabin. I'm like, look at all these. <laughs> Progressively the less clothing. We're gonna have to. Yeah, it's just like, <laughs> like a couple of us on like a bearskin rug and, like, you know, these are going out on the wall. Or they would have if the wall hadn't crashed in that bar. But we'll make a new wall. I love you, John. Your silence is hard. And I love you too. Oh. And we ride off. To the sun. There we go. There we go. It was actually kind of fun. God, that was nuts. But fun. <laughs> Imagine if Calvin and Matt had been here, nothing would have gotten done again. Oh god. Oh, absolutely not. I love I love to actually run one of these like mini one offs. I'm not gonna lie. Do if it. you guys would ever be down for that, I'd be I'd be down to do that. Doing one eventually too. That'd be cool to just do these one-offs. I think it's like good practice. It know? is, and it really is great practice for just like off the cuff. Managing to ram it. Yeah. Like, well, and you're right. Like doing character voices definitely helps. Yeah. So, John, thank you for opening my eyes. I don't know it's just easier to distinguish when you're like just table talking or when you're actually yeah yeah i actually i actually uh i have to go meet some people somewhere so <clears throat> i'm gonna have to get off i apologize all this righty was, this was fun you guys i'm glad i'm glad we did this you know yeah it's good fun so good fun uh i will Catch you guys on the on the flip side. All right. Catch you on the flippy ah. flip. Catch you on the flippy flip. Boy. Adios.